Hello and welcome to the A1 Telecom Austria wholesale webinar for IoT detection. The Internet of Things is the next big thing and is already present in many areas of our lives. However, the rollout of 5G technology will drive the growth of IoT even faster. Mobile operators around the globe are directly affected by this trend. Not only will the human roaming customer generate traffic and consequently revenue, but there will also be many more IoT devices roaming in mobile networks. But is your mobile network ready for the new trend? The good news first, A1 Wholesale has already done its homework and is able to provide an IoT detection tool that gives insights into all your IoT-related roaming traffic. In this webinar, we will guide you step by step to an understanding of why IoT detection is crucial for mobile operators. We would like to introduce you to Peter. Peter lives in Austria, where he has a family and owns a house. As a businessman who works in the logistics industry, he spends a lot of time traveling. He is an active sportsman who simply loves gadgets. He owns a fitness tracker, a robotic lawnmower and a smart fridge that lets him see the food inside without having to open the door. Last year he bought a new car and when he personalized the car settings he was offered internet access on the display. In his job Peter provides logistic services to his clients where it's all about smart container transportation. Being able to check where the containers are located at any specific moment is essential so that he can see if the delivery is on schedule. Peter's personal and business life is full of IoT. All the gadgets he uses need to communicate and there is a high probability that they have a SIM card built into them. Usually, this SIM card is able to communicate from anywhere in the world as the majority of vendors produce their goods for the global market. Peter's company has tens of thousands of containers in circulation. These containers use IoT technology to report their current location and their contents. These examples show how strong demand is for communication via the Internet of Things. And you can see the enormous potential for the future. In the world of global markets, it is obvious that roaming also plays a significant role in IoT-related communications. Let's have a closer look at the technical aspects of the communication. Let's assume that Peter is traveling to Mexico. As soon as he turns on his mobile device, there will be some signaling messages sent between the foreign network his phone is about to log into and his home network, so the operators can exchange the details of Peter's contract. Once the smartphone is connected, Peter will probably retrieve his business emails. This will activate a data session and due to home routing, data traffic will be exchanged between Mexico and Austria. The Mexican network will generate call detail records CDRs, for this traffic which will be charged to the Austrian provider, which will subsequently invoice its customer for the roaming data volume. Usually CDRs are the only source of information for billing roaming traffic. The majority of IoT-capable devices contain SIM cards from a dedicated mobile operator and an IoT device might be sold to a customer in a different country. In this case, the SIM card will be in roaming mode, just like Peter's phone. The IoT device starts the same connection process as Peter's phone, but there is one significant difference. Peter might talk a lot, check his email and browse the web but the IoT device will probably just send a limited amount of information. Only the typical signaling messages will be exchanged, but no data traffic or any other traffic that will incur charges will be recorded from the Mexican network, which means that no CDR will be generated. Of course, if there is no CDR, there is also no revenue for the visited network operator. Now we know why the development of IoT roaming traffic is a challenge for mobile operators. Networks like the Mexican one are being utilized, but IoT users are not paying properly for this utilization. This is why A1 developed the IoT detection tool. As we learned earlier, the majority of IoT traffic cannot be measured from the CDR files. To achieve full visibility of roaming users in the network, we take signaling information to drill down the IoT devices. But let's have a closer look at the tool and the possibilities it offers. The IoT detection tool is integrated into our well-known advanced reporting application, where we summarize the roaming CDRs, named TAP files, and the signaling information from all types of human or IoT traffic and technology, from 2G to future 5G. 
based on typical IoT parameters such as IMSI ranges, APN, EMI and many others, we can now clearly distinguish between all kinds of traffic. First we have an overview of the active users in the network and are able to clearly identify the IoT related portion as our base are tab files, which leads to the chart Users Tab All and Signaling Data which generates the User Signaling All path. This ratio is an important indicator of your network usage. As we can see, there are big differences depending on the subscriber's home network. Some operators are already very active on the IoT market and are using your network resources undetected by your existing tools. Silent and zero-rated users are the most interesting as these devices are using your network resources but are not generating traffic that can be invoiced under today's contracts. With the A1 IoT detection tool, you can identify and report precisely these devices in your network. The ability to prove this data supports your business and helps you start charging your roaming partners. Wow, Peter's life has certainly given us plenty of insights. We have learned that IoT traffic is omnipresent and is expected to record explosive growth. IoT detection is therefore essential if mobile operators are to maintain control over the roamers in their network and charge them properly. If you want to learn more about the A1 IoT detection tool and the endless possibilities it offers for getting more out of your IoT roaming traffic, contact our team for a demo or trial installation. By the way, the deployment and integration of the tool is completely independent of any other service. Stay tuned for the next webinar. Thank, Thank you and, and goodbye. goodbye.